Well, many of us are trying to stay home to help stop the spread of coronavirus. And there's one old school activity that is making a big comeback. And so we do have Fox's Jayla Whitfield with the details on this fun activity for the whole family. So hello, Jayla. Hi, Christy. Thank you so much for having me. That's right. Nationwide drive-in movie theaters are becoming more popular. They're providing a nostalgic way for families to get together and spend time together during the coronavirus pandemic. Just like this one right there, this one right here, seats are selling out. Dozens of cars lined up to escape the pandemic. The Starlight Drive-In Theater in Atlanta is back open after the coronavirus forced it to close. Everybody was there. It was crowded. It was a packed house. Hughes and her husband visited the drive-in last week. They say it's a nice way to just see other people. It just, I still felt connected to the people in, at the drive-in because we all needed to get out. We all needed a reprieve. The revival of drive-in movie theaters is happening all over the country. Fridays and Saturday nights were selling out. We're seeing a lot of people coming from a long distance. Watts owns a drive-in theater in Ocala, Florida. He says staying open is about more than just money. It goes back to uh, Hurricane Katrina. I was a victim of Katrina on the Mississippi coast and anything that brought uh, just a few minutes of what seemed to be a normal life to us is the thing that we rem remember the most. Watts is taking precautions by cutting vehicle capacity by 50 percent. I fenced off every other parking space here so they have anywhere from 10 to 12 feet between them and the next vehicle on either side of them. According to the United Drive-Ins Owner Association, there are over 300 drive-ins across the country and some are facing financial setbacks. Yes, are we losing money? Absolutely. Grimm's Theater in Greenville, New York doesn't open until May, but the owners are already planning ahead. You'll be able to text from your car, I want popcorn, I want a hot dog, etc. and we'll run it out to your car. Drive-in theaters say they are working around the clock to provide a safe place to go during an unprecedented time. I hope people realize that in no matter what the disaster is, the drive-ins are safe. Dozens of And the owners of drive-in theaters say they've seen an increase in traffic. They expect that since social distancing is in the works, that drive-ins will become more popular. Christy? Yeah, thank you so much, Jayla, for joining us live. I know this is one of the many activities that we're all trying to get out and do while we're still staying safe. So thank you again for joining us live. And thank just you. so you know, we do have right here in our very own Phoenix area, I just saw this was posted on Facebook, drive-ins at the princess. So if you do want to go and check that out, I'm going to be posting it to my Facebook page. They've been showing many different children themed movies, obviously trying to target those families, but even have a special ticket price for you to get not only in and park your car, but also some special treats as well.